In April 2017, DJ Khaled released I'm the One, a single featuring Justin Bieber, Quavo, One Third of Migos, Chance the Rapper, and Lil Wayne, that ended up becoming one of last summer's most played songs, it was perhaps only eclipsed on the Song of the Summer leaderboard by a different entry featuring Bieber, Luis Fonsi's Despacito. The video which has by now accumulated over a billion views features a very different Bieber than the one we have seen this past summer, of 2018, the Bieber that has been touring the country with new fiancé Haley Baldwin, the Bieber who wears hotel slippers on the street, the Bieber whose dirty blonde hair is reaching Nick Nolte mugshot levels of unruliness. No, the Bieber of the I'm the One video is fairly clean cut. Within the video's first minute, the pop star is seen in the following get-ups, shirtless, in swim trunks, with a red bandana around his buzz cut, sporting a black supreme jersey and black skinny jeans, and wearing a confusing reversible Emery bomber jacket, available on the Barney's website for $2,750. Bieber parades around the mansion at which the video was filmed, hands in the air, mouthing, I'm the one. And he is the one. He points to the camera a bunch. He crouches. He semi-dabs. When he sings the word ride, he mimics driving a car. He looks at his watch when crooning the word time. Pretty standard fare for a Justin Bieber in a DJ Khaled video scenario, there's a little bit of posturing, but Bieber mostly comes off as, well, a decently cool famous person. Today, Khaled released No Brainer, a likable single featuring, again, Bieber, Chance, and Quavo, no Wayne this time around, presumably in hopes of mimicking last summer's success. As with any sequel, it's hard not to feel a bit like this is a retread, if an inoffensive one. The fact that it's called No Brainer also feels like it's offered to us with a bit of a wink why wouldn't we release another one of these Sonic Slam Dunks into the Spotify and Apple Music streaming assembly lines. It's notable though that this Bieber, while equally invested, he dances and shimmies and mugs for the camera, is wearing, for the majority of the video, a simple black t-shirt, drawstring black sweatpants, and a blue cap. He has a prominent mustache and a mullet. His shoes are checker printed slip-ons, worn with colorful socks. On some level, Bieber is on trend with his no-brainer aesthetic, as well as with his streetwear looks this summer. Pete Davidson, Jonah Hill, and others have similarly received accolades and Instagram double taps for their scumbro fits. But Bieber seems to be trying even less hard than those guys. Whereas it seems clear that Davidson and Hill are extremely knowledgeable and well studied about what they're choosing to wear, for Bieber, well, it just seems like he wants to be comfortable. Correspondingly, his physicality and demeanor come off as more at ease and unmannered in this video, too don't they? You could easily imagine this summer 2018 Bieber watching the I'm the one video and wincing, finding his look from a year ago corny. This, of course, is the way most of us would react to footage of ourselves from our pasts, too. Perhaps, gollivanting with Baldwin, wearing sweats and basketball shorts, hopping on songs with his friends when he feels like it, represents a kind of optimal Bieber. As our Justin Bieber, after all sorts of trials, tribulations, ups, and downs, figured it all out. This summer, at least, he seems to be embodying a no-brainer lifestyle that perhaps we all can try to learn from, a lifestyle where one tries, as best one can, to not think about anything too hard and just go with the obvious choice.